bought to quit on your own, Buck. Well, you didn't give me much choice, did you, McGarrett? Unless you were bluffing about coming down to bring me in if I didn't show. Now, what's this all about? That's something that belongs to you. Over $78,000, including two that we took off Joe Wang's body. What well, makes you think it belongs to me? Look, Buck, I'm going to get right to the point, and I'm only going to make it once. Joe Wang was skimming from you. <laughs> what? Yeah, you knew it, and that's why you had him burned. Me? You. And you had his apartment torn apart. You're looking for this. Now, wait a minute, McGarrett. You hold it right there. After you telephoned me, I called my lawyer. He's on his way down here now, so any more now, questions you, look at, you got... I didn't call you... you in here to ask you. I called you in here to tell you something. There was a witness to Wang's murder. And your hitter saw the witness, chased him, and tried to kill him. Oh, really? Yeah. And don't pretend that I'm telling you something you don't already know, because I know better. And I know that your boys are beating the bush looking for him. We were talking. I thought you had him already. <laughs> if I had him, you'd really need a lawyer. And when I find him, the whole Hawaii Bar Association is not going to keep you from going inside. Thanks for the warning. I wouldn't knock it, Buck, because I'm going to make you a promise from now on. Every time a body turns up with a hole in it, I'm going to haul you in. And I'm going to keep the heat on you until you drown in your own sweat. Now, take your money and get out of here. Nice try, McGarrett. Next time, it won't be a try. It'll be murder one and I'm gonna make it stick. That's a promise. <laughs>